Okay, uh, first thing we need to talk about um, with the Quiver app project is the materials. And the big one is that one right in the middle there, the Quiver.day printout. That might be a little bit difficult for people to get printed out while we're at home, while we're virtual. So let's talk about some options to see if we can figure out how to get that printed out if you don't have a printer at home. Um, the first option would be, uh, can someone print it out somewhere else? Is there someone at home, do you have a parent that could maybe get that printed out somewhere else? Um, that would be the first option. Uh, another option would be, uh, can you stop in at the Northside School office because I can have a stack of these printouts there available to pick up if you want to stop in and pick it up or somebody can stop in and pick it up. Um, and then the other option is just get in touch with Mr. Lawton and see if we can figure something out. Uh, maybe we can get a hold of uh, a printout to you some way. Um, and then if all else fails, uh, we will be able to do this project when we get back in person in two, three weeks. Um, so we will be able to do this at some point if you cannot get that printout, but you will need that printout done. Okay, let's get on to um, all the steps to make this project work. Okay, so uh, next project is with using Quiver, the Quiver app, um, which is a 3D um, application, and that there is the handout, which I put in your folder. Um, I'll talk more about that in a bit. Uh, those are some uh, drawing things. Uh, so you can use markers or colored pencil, and you will also need your iPad. To get the Quiver app, you can go to self-service, and then I hit search, and then I type in Quiver. Q-U-I-V-E-R. And that's what it will look like. It will, it will be sort of bluish and it will have a butterfly on the app logo. I already have it on my desktop, so I will find that. It's right there. And that's the Quiver app. Uh, the handout here is one that I've already colored in, um, and I'm going to show you here. I'll click on the the uh, Quiver app, and then right at the bottom there is a orange circle with a butterfly in it. You click on that, and then you aim it at your piece of paper, and there you can see that it turns your your circle into a 3D sphere. And that is what it will look like. And at the bottom there, there's an orange button there. You can hit that and it should start my sphere spinning. And then I have another one here I can show you quickly, which is a different uh, drawing here. I did the planet Earth as North America, South America. You take the Quiver app, you hit the orange button at the bottom there. Whoa, right there. And then if you see that it's sort of uh, yellow and then it's going blue, when it's blue it's working, when it's sort of orange, red, it's not working, there it goes blue and it starts to work. And then again, I'm going to hit that orange button there in the bottom left hand corner and it will start my planet Earth spinning. So that's how it works. Uh, have fun with it.